Hey, hey, how are you doing? Holmes here, and welcome back to some more God of War Ragnarok boss guy. Today, we are going to be taking on another Berserker, and this is going to be another one of those early game Berserkers. Uh, this is going to be the... I'm just calling him the Lightning Berserker, because that's all it does. So, let's see. Okay, this move where it just sends these lightning things on the ground. Be careful, because the last one always, like... It's always, like, set in the path you're going, so you kind of have to juke him. And then after that, it'll come down, the boss will come down, and then you just whack them. Uh, the, project the projectile throw that I just did, you can either block or parry it. That lightning shock that just came by, you can dodge it by rolling towards sideways. The ground shockwave thing that it did, you can just block that. Um, it has this projectile throw that you cannot block, so you can dodge it by rolling sideways. And as I call the Berserker, it has that freaking body slam thing. So. Yeah, roll sideways to avoid that. Uh, the punching attack, you can either parry or block it. And... That's it. <laughs> this is also in Svartoheim. I think that's how you say the name. But yeah, that's pretty much it for its attacks. Um, this one and uh, the one with the sword. I think it's the only one with the sword. The one that only has three moves. Um, oh, also that move. Yes, I forgot to mention that. I forgot this guy even had that. Uh, the delay attack with the uh, with the lightning. You can see him like raise his hand. When he gets close to you, you'll see him raise his hand, and then he'll do this like shock explosion thing, which has a little bit of delay in it. Uh, if you guys watched uh, my other Berserker fights, some of them also have that move. And pretty much when you see it, it's a yellow ring attack when he gets close to you so yeah if you see a yellow ring pop up as he raises his arm right next to you uh wait like about a second or two and then parry because if you parry too early you're gonna get hit by the lightning all right and he's doing the one that's that sends the shock wave again okay he ran around circle there just avoided this time I wasn't strafing so I can see where I'm going. Alright, dodge sideways. What you got? What you got? Yeah, that move right there. If you end up like blocking it, it's gonna guard break you and he's gonna follow it up with um, his freaking patch mate and pull punches. So be careful. If you're not confident in parrying it, uh, you can always dodge backwards or use uh, Spartan Rage Valor. Alright, and yeah, that's gonna, that's pretty much it for the the Lightning Berserker. I just noticed, this is the first Berserker I fought with um, mainly the axe. And I don't know, like, when it comes to Berserker fights, I just got, or boss fights in general, I got so used to just using the, the spear. It's, it just felt like it's faster. And it has a little bit more reach. As to you know the the axe, <laughs> I think the axe has like it's mostly about damage, and then the blades are about like speed and range, and then the spear it's probably the most balanced in my opinion. Uh, but yeah, there are my gears and skills. Thank you all so very much for watching, and I hope to catch you all next time. Oops, oops.